wonderful collab with my beautiful friend Naomi from Beauty Dreams with Naomi. And uh, she reached out and asked if I wanted to do a collab using one of the uh, BH Cosmetics. Um, they came out as a set. They're the Weekend Vibes palette. And so we decided to use the Blueberry Muffin one. I love all three color stories of the three palettes that came out with, with this set. But there's just something about this one that I just thought was so unique. And if you know Naomi, you know she loves blues and she loves cool tones. So this palette is like right up her alley. So we're just going to do any look we want using any shades, any number, whatever. And uh, so I'm super excited. Um, automatically, I wanted to go towards the browns. <laughs> because blue is one of my scary shades along with black and gray. But I decided I'm gonna go into some of the blues and I think I'm gonna do like a brown with it. A brown, you know, I think the combo of blue and brown together is really pretty. So that's what I'm gonna try to do. So I'm gonna take a flippy brush and I'm gonna start out with Delish. And I love BH's shadow formula. Their shadows are pigmented, they're beautiful, they're blendable. So I know I'm gonna love this palette. This is my first time using it. I think Naomi's used hers a couple of times. So, oh yeah, that's really pretty. Really, really, really pretty. And it went on really nice. I think BH is one of the best shadow formulas, not just for the price, because they are very affordable, but just in general. I think it stands up to high end. I really do. And I'm going to take it pretty close to my brow bone. I've been trying to uh, do that more, go closer to my brow bone, because as I said, I have hooded lids and I don't have a lot of eye space, so I need to utilize more of it. I don't see any fallout. That is just really pretty. I'm going to go in with a little bit more. I don't know that I need to, but I always want to. <laughs> If I were a betting person, I would bet that Naomi's going to use the blues as well, but she might surprise me. You never know. Um, she has used this palette before, so she might be wanting to uh, use some shades she hasn't tried. So I'm excited to see what she does with it. Her looks are always beautiful. She is such a uh, great you say blender <laughs> her her she, her blending skills are amazing her looks just look you can't tell where one color starts and it, and the other ends it just looks like it all just comes from the same place I mean it is just beautiful beautiful she recently did a look that was like uh, cotton candy bliss and unicorns I mean it was just so stunning I think if I would have tried to pull that look off and, and use those colors together, I would have looked like <laughs> a clown. <laughs> but she is so talented. Well, I got this eye a dark, darker, so I'm going to go in and up the ante on this one as well. Always easier to add more than it is to take away. So, okay, I'm gonna move on, take a crease brush, and go into So Good. It's a darker blue. These are sort of gray, purpley. Blues, they don't, they're not like true, true blue to me. That's bugging me. I went a little far down there with that blue. And I'm going to take this directly into my socket. Carve me out 
a crease that can be seen since my hood hides mine. I didn't know this look was going to go quite this blue, <laughs> this deep, but we're in now, so no turning back. <laughs> recently Naomi's birthday so I want to wish her a happy birthday and she did a big birthday haul and she got some amazing new products and I cannot wait to see her use them um, she has a beautiful collection and a large collection and uh, she does haul lots of hauls girl after my own heart um, she does mostly high-end, I would say. Um, well, a lot of high-end. Whereas, I haul a lot of, you know, like, super affordable. Um, she stores her collection in these really pretty, like, feminine, romantic uh, furniture pieces. White and floral and uh, girly. And she has beautiful, like, trays where she sets stuff. And I mean, her, her setup is just gorgeous she displays her palettes and it is so beautiful i love it when people i'm going to take that first brush with that blue and go back above this dark blue it looks like i lost some of that lighter blue but i love it when people store their collections in you know unique pieces pieces that you know show their personality rather than just the white ikea drawers those are great too and um if i could afford them i probably would get those but uh you know, I really like, you know, collections that are more personal. I don't know. I just like it. I like it to see someone's personality and, in, you know, their makeup stored in a unique way. Um, she does lots of collabs, and um, she's in a couple of collab groups, I believe. And uh, she does beautiful looks, as I've said. And just, she does lots of different things. You know, you will find something that you like on her channel. I'm certain of it. Absolutely certain of it. She has the most soothing voice and these beautiful, bright, crystal clear eyes. And um, she's just stunning. She's stunning. Absolutely stunning. And she's so sweet and supportive. And I just, I just love her. She's one of my very best friends here on YouTube. So sorry. Things for kids. <laughs> Free roller coaster ride? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Naomi, I'm really sorry. But y'all know I don't edit, so. <laughs> Oops. But I knocked over a bunch of crap, so I'm going to have to pick all that up. So, anyways, let's do the outer V. And I'm going to go into this uh, brown, chocolate brown shade called Decadent. It's like a cool tone brown. I'm just barely going to tap into it because I don't want to go too, 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 too hand because I go toward, oh, that looks kind of purpley blended over that blue, doesn't it? Oh my goodness. Is that purple? Let me swatch that. Well, that is purple. Look at that. I thought that was brown. Well, that changed everything up <laughs> it did it totally changed the way i'm gonna do this look so anyways okay i was gonna go brown and blue and now i'm going purple and blue well that purple really pops over that blue doesn't it well meatball has entered the building so he's probably gonna lay over there and cry because i am um doing this instead of paying attention to him. He is a very needy boy. Took him to the vet uh, Monday to get his last set of shots. Uh, and he is fully vaccinated now. And uh, he is four and a half months old. And he weighs 84.5 pounds. <laughs> and the vet said 
he is going to be massive. So I'm thinking he might even outweigh my mojo who weighed 203 pounds when he passed away. So I'm thinking that Meatball might weigh as much, if not more, than Modi. That will be crazy. He does like to eat. Uh, and Canyon, the little guy that I recently rescued, the little pit bull, he, uh, the vet told me he is a, uh, blue tiger stripe brindle. And, uh, when I got him, you could totally see every bone in his body, every rib, every vertebrae in his back, and uh, he was so tiny. Well, uh, today, he weighed 29 pounds, so I'm very happy he's doing good. Okay, that's uh, as good as I'm going to get that. So, everybody's doing good. Saint's great. Um, Bubba Gump is... <laughs> He's, he's still alive and kicking. Okay, so let's do a lid shade. I was going to go with this, but since this turned out to be purple, I think I'm going to go with Yummy here. So. I'm going to spray it with my Mario Badescu spray. I spray every shimmer regardless of brand. That's really pretty. Totally different look than I had saw when I was picking out my shades. I need to wash my brushes. Oh my gosh. They are pitiful. I am going to take hmm. I guess I'll take this shade under my lower lash line y'all I'm just almost tipped all over again Your shadow formula, they are so good, so pigmented. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna do some of uh, this shade here, it is called Sugar, and I'm gonna do that under my brow bone in my inner corner. Drop my mirror. All right, I'm gonna use the one in the palette. <laughs> this look just went wild on me. <laughs> Corner. 
I was going to do a blue liner, but I think now I want to do a purple one. So, let's use this LA Girl Pastel Dream Eyeliner in Lavender. Put that in the waterline. And those go on so good. I love them. I do. Alrighty. So, I'm going to go off here. I am going to put on some of this Lash Paradise Mascara. It is almost on its last leg. And uh, I'll have to pick out a different lippy than the one I chose. And I'll be back to do some lips. The shadows performed great, and the colors are really pretty. I just, blue eye looks on me are just not my thing. So, anyways, um, not mad at it, just not one of my favorite looks that I have uh, ever done. And so, now let's put on my lippy. I chose kind of a neutral lip. It is a Luna by Luna lip gloss in the color Mars. sheer. I'm going to try to build it up a little bit. But I think it's mostly just going to add some shine. Which is okay because this eye look is presence all its own. Huh. There it is. Naomi, I'm sorry it was so lackluster, honey. Um, I know her look is going to be amazing, and um, I can't wait to see what it is. Thank you so, so much for um, asking me to collab with you, and especially for being my friend and so sweet and kind and supportive and always there for me. And um, I love you so much. If you like these types of videos, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Love to all. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.